today we'll start the interesting topic that is kinetic theory of gases similarly that is kinetic theory of gases we know in the previous chapters we discussed the three quantities say three parameters that is pressure temperature volume and heat contents so in the kinetic theory basically what we study we study that how these parameters are affected and how these parameters come into existence and similarly the kinetic means there will be some motion so in this theory we will study we will discuss that these parameters will somewhere depend on the motion of the gases particles so we know the possibility of a gas particle of its motion is like this it will move in this direction and return back to this direction and again this direction and again this direction so it will oscillates around its mean position this is the mean position let us call so it will go in this direction and in this direction so this type of the motion is known as oscillatory motion so one the possibility with the gas particle is that the motion will be oscillatory second part the particle will move in this direction in this direction in a straight line so we'll say that particle is moving in straight line motion now the third possibility is this that the charged particle will move in this direction in a circular path whenever a charged particle or a gas particle go in this direction forming a circular motion then what will you say we say that this is in angular motion there will be angular motion or angular acceleration angular these are the basic principle and all these three types need a type of motion so a charged particle can perform these three type of the motions the oscillatory straight line and these are the types of so what we study that how these oscillatory motion how the straight line motion and how the angular motion will come into existence so briefly i say that all these motions required a type of velocity isn't it means is particle ko yahan se idhar move karke jana hai तो इसके पास कोई ना कोई वेलोसिटी होना चाहिए इस तरह से मूवमेंट कर रहा है एंगुलर मोशन कर रहा है तो इस टाइम भी कोई वेलोसिटी चाहिए यहां से ये ओसिलेटरी मोशन कर रहा है तो यहां पे भी कोई ना कोई वेलोसिटी तो चाहिए तो डायरेक्टली भी से दैट वेन अवर देर इज ए मोशन इन द गैस पार्टिकल इट रिक्वाइड ए वेलोसिटी सो टू अंडरस्टैंड ऑल दिस पैरामीटर्स ऑल दिस कॉन्सेप्ट लेट स्टार्ट विथ सम टर्मिनोलॉजी the first terminology we will discuss is terminologies gas terminology bolenge hum usko first terminology that is mean free path mean free path what is it let us suppose i have a charged particle here i have a charged particle here now this charged particles and another charged particle here let us suppose this charged particle this gas particle start to move in this direction and reach up to this point the moment of this direction is in this type now after striking after collision with this gas particle what will happen with this this gas particle the gas particle which is moving in this direction after striking here after striking here there will be collision and we assume that this type of the collision is elastic collision whenever this electron this gas particle stack to this it will reflect back in some direction with same velocity let us suppose this will go in this direction and reach here again we assume that a gas particle is also present here at this point so it will again stack here and there will be some collision and it will move in this direction let us suppose now this particle reach here and again we find that a gas particle also present here 
and after making a collision with this particle the particle the initial gas particle that is one will move in this direction and reach here so the particle when move from here to here ye path jo usne travel kiya from this point to this point that is a b c d and this point is e this path is known as the free path so first definition we say free path i will start to describe free path free path is defined as the path between path between two successive collision between two conjugative two conjugative molecules what is the path between two conjugative molecules without collision let us suppose the particle move from here to here in this direction there is no any collision in this direction no collision means we are satisfying that conjugative molecules which are present without collision so we will quote it as a free path this is the free path so we describe here ab is free path then bc is free path then cd is free path and d is also a free path all these lines all these displacement are known as free path now we have to define the mean free path now add all these free paths and take the mean of this that is known as mean free path ab plus bc plus cd plus d divided by how much 1 2 3 4 4 quantities that is equal to l this is the known as mean free path so this path is known as mean free this is the basic definition for mean mean free path the free path between two successive collision ya fir two conjugate molecules without collision jitna wo path travel kar sakte hain so this is the basic definition now we have to define some postulates about that means we have to assume some things before discussing the gas theory so next right postulates of kinetic what we required we have to assume something let us suppose main aapse kahu ki main atom ke size ko ek spherical surface manta means i am considering the surface means i am considering the shape of the molecule as a spherical why i considering there is no reason because it is naturally we define that shape is no in the spherical terms so always what type of the calculation what type of the assumption we are doing there is no practical calculation for that so we term these type of the concept or these type of assumption as postulates of kinetic theory which will help us to understand kinetic theory in a deep version so first thing postulate of kinetic theory first postulate is that shape of atom shape of atom or molecule is spherical means we have to consider the shape of the atom and molecule in spherical the atoms or molecules the second assumption in it the atoms or molecules are in the state of continuous motion means jo state hogi jo inke molecules ki motion hoga wo mein se continuous motion hoga they will not consider at stationary position and the velocity of this motion the velocity of this motion may be jo velocity is ki vary kar sakti hai so state here shape of the atoms or the molecule is spherical why spherical because naturally we state that all this type like a water molecule like our universe also in the by nature we consider this in spherical type second assumption second postulate states that this states that the average distance the average distance between molecules is 10 times or larger than its own size of two angstrom what it state it states that let us suppose 
I have a molecule this one having the radius around 2 angstrom and another molecule having the radius 2 angstrom what is stated there the average distance between two molecule is 10 times or larger than its own size I mean this is the size and if i consider the displacement the separation between this then this separation this separation will be 10 times of the size of the molecule so it will be 20 angstrom that's why the gas molecules are spread whenever they leave to in a free space agar hum ek kamre mein gas molecules ko chhod de to pure kamre mein wo phail jate hain kyun because they have a nature that the average distance between two molecules will be 20 angstrom or say more 10 times of their own size and third postulate states that that all the collisions all the collisions or say the third what is stated that the molecules move in a straight line move in a straight line and due to large distance the force of interaction the force of the interaction due to any field is negligible the only interaction the only interaction is collision means we are saying that that only the conclusion only the kind type of the collision is elastic collision or say interaction let us suppose this is the molecule this is the earth and this is the earth is revolving in this direction why because there is a gravitational attraction between these molecules if i remove the attraction then what will happen the particle or say earth will go in this direction so why because there is no gravitational field similarly if we have molecules which are revolving in the direction here let us suppose this is the very far away from this molecule there is no effect of this on this and this on this so what will happen the particle will trace a straight path and if there is any interaction with around other molecule then the interaction will be known as only by collision because when it strike to this only then it will interact with any molecule so this is the third postulate which state that only elastic collision will be take place or say collision will take place the fifth the fourth postulate said the collision the collisions are totally elastic in nature what is the meaning of elastic elastic means that momentum and second one that is energy will conserve means hum ye kahenge ki hamari jo energy hoti hai jo molecules ki ya jo gas particles ki energy hoti hai will always conserved when there is a collision between two molecules and the fifth postulate which state that volume of a gas is taken as volume of a gas is taken as total volume covered by its molecules including vacant space between yani ye kahe ki agar do molecule aise itna space hai unke beech mein अब मैं क्या करता हूँ उनको पास पास लाने की कोशिश करता हूँ तो मिनिममली एक ये मानो ये है अगर हमको मिनिमली ऐसे लेके आए इनको इतना इंट्रेक्शन करवा दूं मैं कि इनको बिल्कुल पास पास ले तो अब जितना वॉल्यूम ये एक्वायर कर रहे हैं दैट इज द टोटल वॉल्यूम टेकन मीन्स जब भी हम वॉल्यूम की बात करेंगे तो हम ये बात करेंगे कि उनके बीच में मिनिमम डिस्टेंस हो और जो आस उनके वैकेंट स्पेस हो उसको भी कंसिडर करके कितना वो वॉल्यूम एक्वायर कर रहे हैं दैट इज नोन एज वॉल्यूम ऑफ एक्वायर बाई दैस so these are the basic postulates which we should keep in our mind while studying ktg that is kinetic gas theory so briefly we state what we defined that the parameters pressure temperature volume how they effect how they come into existence next we study that what type of the motion a gas particle can do oscillatory straight line and angular then we study the basic terminology that is mean free path and the postulate of kinetic theory first this one and all these three five postulates we have to study so next we study 
that how the pressure how the mathematical expression will be carried out in the case of gas or say how the numerical value will be provided mathematically by using kinetic theory of gas which will stay in next lecture thank you